Sags, what is going on? You're on early today. How you doing? Okay. Clock Tower 3. Started this game yesterday and it's been really fun so far. Hundred times better than the game before it. I don't want that mouse pointer showing. Let me fix that. Doing well? How about yourself? I'm doing just fine today. I'm a little, a little tired. I think uh, I may have had too much to eat during lunch and it kind of wiped me out. I feel like it's a Thanksgiving afternoon. There we are. No more cursor. So much nicer looking. All right. I got a big old glass of cold coffee here, so. Cold black coffee. That'll wake me up. So we just beat chapter one in this game, dealt with Sledgehammer, and uh, got sent back to our own time, seemingly. Dennis, what are you doing here? Hold me up. Hurry. Everyone's so aggressively British. Oh, let that nerd fall. I hope he dies. I already ate him. Phew, I thought I was a goner for sure. Long time no see, Alyssa. I haven't seen you since we were in primary school together. Calm down with my pillow over there. Three years? What do you think you're doing entering a lady's residence through a window? I have to give you something. Ah, here it is. It's the key to my grandfather's room. Mother always has this key with her. What are you doing with it? You saw her? When and where? Calm down, calm down. It was yesterday morning and your mother drove by in her car. Oh, and she said you might come back from boarding There school. is so much crazy movement like, going on here. What in the world? It's like a hyperactive cutscene. Hey, Alyssa, you've really changed since I last saw you. I'm going to go and check my grandfather's room. Hey! Well... It looks like you've grown up too, Dennis. Oh, come on. That was then and this is now. Wait a minute, would you? What is he doing? <laughs> oh, what an insane cutscene. Sorry, Orange Sags, I couldn't check your message. That was just something I couldn't look away from. I don't drink coffee too much anymore. I drank this triple strength coffee in an accident. My heart felt like it was going to explode. Uh, I've been there, but I love coffee very much. I don't do, like, the K-cup thing. I don't really do, like, Starbucks-type coffees, but just the nice brewed... Some nice brewed black coffee from home. I think we usually do Folgers. Oh, yeah. That's my stuff. Let's see. Where was my grandpa's room? You have Peace Coffee where you live. I am not at all familiar with Peace Coffee. I don't believe so. It's mostly a Starbucks here, and uh, I don't know what. There's, like, some people like Dunkin', like Dunkin' Donuts Coffee. I hate Dunkin's Coffee. Um... I don't like McDonald's coffee, and I know that's another one some people like. I don't know, maybe I'm a coffee snob, except I don't think Folgers is snobbish, right? Like, it's it's cheap, regular coffee. Oh, hey, ah! Where'd the heck, freaking ghost? Get out of here. There's a bathroom ghost. Someone got killed in our bathroom? Oh my. Dead body in here of all places. One of the lodgers? Woo, what a stink. I admit I did not see that coming. 
Did not see it coming. Well, how do I know what the bathroom lady wants? I have to bring her something that she wants. That's right next to my bedroom, too. Well, this is my mom's room. Hmm. What the? Another painting stuck under the first one, only this one has a clock on it. What well, time is that, is that? Which is the minute and which is the hour hand? That's kind of hard to tell. I think that's showing 12.15. But it could be 3 o'clock. But I think it's 12.15. Where's the clock? Oh, well, right here. That's not a very hard mystery. I need special winding keys. Okay, I gotta find the winding keys. But I don't know. I'm not a big fan of, um, like, super sugary coffee. Which is weird for me because I am a fan of very sweet things. Like, I love sweets. But I want, I want my coffee black. Black and bitter. Like, I don't want extra flavor added to it. Alright. Well, whatever I need's not in here. Way to find Grandpa's room. No, stop it. Hmm. Wait, this was the main room. This is my bedroom? Wait, I'm all turned around. Where the heck am I? This was to the lodgers area. Wait, don't I have a map? I'm like making this more difficult than it needs to be. I think I have a map. Maybe I don't? Never mind, maybe I don't have a map. Oh, there's a map in the background there. Select button, map. Only not from here. Hey, there we are. Uh, they're not labeled. Okay, I'm in that room next to the table. So maybe Grandpa's, Grandpa's room must be downstairs. Or... No, no, that's where my room was. East coffee is more like you buy the beans in the bag. I just know someone who worked there, so if you ever want free coffee, hey. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah, I have not tried peace coffee, but I'm interested then. I'll maybe look into it sometime. Could I just buy it at like a regular grocery store? Or is it, like, specialized? Where I live, it's at Target and stuff? Okay. Dick's room key, yes. Here we are. Hopefully we'll find all these old books. What was he studying? That is a lot of books. Muchos bookos. These masks are unnerving. You staying here. Got a missing mask. Missing mask alert. There's a scribbled note. The keys to the mystery of time lie behind you. Oh, we're on a ad break. I'm going to hold on for 30 seconds here. Not do anything. And ad should be over. All right, the keys of the mystery of time lie behind you. Obviously, that'll be for the clock. What could that mean? There's some old books to one side. 
Book of Entities 1. Ooh. Entities have existed in the human realm since Roman days. These beings have been known to possess innocent humans, imbuing them with utter ruthlessness and cruelty, and often driving the possessed to vicious acts of murder. In such cases, executing the murderer does not break the circle of evil. The possessed is resurrected to continue its bloodthirsty mission. Hey, this game's actually giving an explanation. Unlike the last one, now I understand why Sledgehammer came back after they executed him. Those who are thus controlled by entities are known as subordinates. When a subordinate kills a human, they take nourishment from the victim's soul, and their power grows. Subordinates may acquire an infinite amount of power in this manner. It follows, then, the subordinates are sustained by human misery and suffering. Only certain humans are equipped to fight entities and their subordinates. The Rooters. Rooters, who are always young women in their teens, have been battling against these shadowy enemies for hundreds of years. Their war is likely to continue for many centuries to come. Okay, well now they kind of explain why I got a weird bow and arrow and fought the supernatural serial killer. Entities? Rooters? Teenage girls who stand against the forces of darkness? So this is basically horror Sailor Moon, then. Did you find anything in there, Alyssa? What's that? Entity? What's an entity? And the Ruders? So it wasn't a dream. I'm going to look for my mother. You want to look for your mother? But she was in a car, remember? She could be anywhere by now. She's nearby. I can tell. What do you mean? It doesn't matter. Just go home. Let me help you. Just the two of us. It'll be like the old days. That was a long time ago. Well, I might as well help you. There's, there's nothing to do at home. I'm alone in the house until my sister comes back anyway. You mean Linda? Isn't she travelling? Yeah. She's working as a nurse at a refugee camp in Africa. In her last letter, she said she won't be back for at least another six months, so I'm free to babysit, walk dogs, look for missing mothers. Okay. You can check upstairs while I look downstairs. Yes, boss. Hey, one more thing. Isn't it your birthday tomorrow? Huh? My birthday? See, even after all this time, I still remember. What's the matter? Oh... Thing. Now check upstairs, will you? Yeah, can count on me, partner. Oh man, the cutscene direction of this game is wild. I love it. All right. So the clock thing should be back here somewhere. Clock hands or whatever I needed. Said it was behind me. Where behind me? You liar. But I checked everywhere behind me. Make that note again. Uh, the keys to the mystery of time lie behind you. So they should be right back here. You lie. Oh, maybe I need the mask. I used the mask there. It opened some sort of secret compartment where it has the... The keys. Well, either way. Maybe I'm just missing them, but... Oh, that was not behind me. That was to my left, you liar. All right, we got him. Grandfather. Okay, we can go do the clock puzzle. I've been over here. Might as well check every room downstairs since we said we'd look for our mom. Oh, it wasn't locked before. Who could have locked it? Someone locked that door. There they do that. All right, we'll back upstairs. Um, I think this way to that clock room. Well, it was my mom's room. I think. Run by that ghost. 
Stay away. All right, so it was like 12.15. Yeah. Okay, well, the big hand was up. Winding keys might just work on this clock. Use the winding keys, yeesh. Which key will I turn, left or right? Ah, okay. Well, that's not right. Go right. Right again. Well, that's too far. Go left. The left goes what, six, eight hours backwards, and right goes, oh, well, we solved it. Hey. Secret door in Mama's room. Strange medicine bottles stand in line. All kinds of books about witchcraft and hexes. Oh no, my mom's Wiccan. Portal squares. Drawing the portal square as instructed is only the beginning. Remember, the portal square must be thoroughly purified with holy water until it has been sufficiently charged with energy for full effect. Only when the square is infused with light may the practitioner expect any groundbreaking results. Portal squares. I'm guessing that's how I travel through time. Which we've only done accidentally so far. Papers with geometric patterns scatter the desk. Okay. My mom's been up to some wild stuff in here. These windows. How did I never notice there were extra windows before? If I lived in a house, I'm sure I'd notice if there were extra windows from the outside. Strange medicine bottles stand in line. Although it is a massive house. Maybe you wouldn't in a house this big. It's a mansion. What is this strange pattern on the ground? Why on earth was Mummy doing here? It said it needed holy water, right? Should I squirt holy water on it? Oh, it worked! All right. Yes. Okay, we figured it out. The puzzles in this game actually make sense. That's so nice. Although that was not a square, so calling it a portal square feels a little weird. That was clearly a circle. Oh, we're back in time again. A large container has been left outside and is corroded. Where are we? So last time it was like World War II London. Lavender water. But it said it, something about it going all the way back to Roman times. This clearly isn't Roman times, but that, that seems like the furthest back in time we might go. Refill. Very curious what time period when there's a crumbled up newspaper article in the corner family tragedy mother and son in acid bath shocker oh this game is so sad we're gonna have to hear about a little kid taking an acid bath 1963 oh so we're like 20 years later this time 23 november 1963 crawley west sussex so we're still in england Two decomposed corpses were found in a house in Russell Street on Tuesday. The victims were Dorothy Rand, 65, and her toy maker son, Albert Rand, 34. Oh, they weren't. He's not a little kid. The one's an older lady. That's sad, too. They were found in a drum filled with acid in the garage adjoining their house. The suspect is believed to have escaped with a sum of money after the grisly crime. Albert Rand lived together with his mother, a widow, 
who was certified blind and required assistance in everyday tasks. The blind old lady. Mr. Rand's eyes had been gouged out prior to his murder, and police profilers are on the trail of the man who committed such a monstrous crime. Police are seeking the whereabouts of a young man who had been staying with the Rands a few days before the murder, claiming to be a distant relative of Mrs. Rand. He arrived suddenly in the area and has since disappeared. All right, so now we're in the 60s, and there's another crazy serial killer man. Oh, great, a ghost. What's your deal, ghost? You want a teddy bear? Are you not... Can I get by you? Ah! Oh. I can hardly bear to look. There's a heart-shaped pendant in its hand. Give it... I guess don't give it the teddy bear. Oh, wait, it wants the other side of the heart-shaped pendant. Dude, there's ghosts everywhere here. It seems to be locked on the other side. There's another ghost. <laughs> that on the wall says something. Can't read it. The inside of the car is scorched and blackened crushed box in the boot. Was it a present being delivered? Maybe the teddy bear? Just like blood and dead people everywhere. What's going on on this street? Is this what England was like in the 60s? Locked on the other side. We got to help these poor murdered souls. An unseen force is holding that door closed. <laughs> I 
that the old blind old lady's ghost? Shouldn't be able to see me, you dumb blind ghost. Locked and will not open. A book. Albert's Diary. 13 November. Percy from the bakery gave me the name of a good optometrist in London. It's been seven years now since Mum lost her sight, and though she tries to appear cheerful, it's difficult to watch her grow old. Perhaps the doctor can do something to help her. It will be expensive. I wonder if my savings will be enough. 16 November, three days later. Yesterday, a relative of ours named of John Hay... Yo, Seth, what is going on? What's clocking? Well, some mean dude poked out some people's eyes and then apparently burned them in an acid bath and we're gonna hopefully stop them. This game is like incredibly sad backstories for all the ghosts. It's more sad than scary, but it's fun. It's a very fun game so far. Have you played this one? Yesterday, a relative of ours, name of John Hay, came asking if he could stay with us. He was very cordial, but I can't help thinking there's something calculated about him. I said as much to Mother, who scolded me for judging a book by its cover. I suppose she's right. Blood is thicker than water, as they say. And then, like a week later, I've been hearing strange noises late at night for the last three days or so. I hear that a team of burglars have been striking homes in the area. I must remember to lock all the doors and windows at night. You've never touched any Clock Tower game. You know what, Seth? You're missing out. I would rec I would highly recommend most of them. All except for Ghost Head. Which was awful. That was an awful game. The rest have all been very good. Looks like a toolbox. Do you like horror games at all? I know I saw you play, what was it, the Mortuary Assistant? It seemed like you like horror games. Face holds a moonflower. Looks like it's been turned. Turn it. Yes. You play a bunch of horror games. Oh, yeah. You should definitely give Clock Tower a try. Oh, that's right. You played Phasmo once with me. Phasmo is so much fun. Although this is my fourth Clock Tower game in a row, but they're all kind of shortish games, so I'm not really feeling burnt out. Plus, this one's very different from the last three. So it, this one's kind of feeling fresh again. So, ah! So I'm currently in God Eater Grind Fest. I am very interested in God Eater. I saw that you were playing God either, I wanna say yesterday. Uh, I saw you were playing, but I had to do something for a few minutes. And when I came back to try to watch your stream, you had ended the stream. I just missed it apparently. It fire extinguishers back then. I wonder if I could use it for something. Like extinguishing a fire maybe. Wait, is there no door in this room? Ah, oh, there's the door. I'm about ready for, like, a big action game again, after these more slow-paced horror games. What? I'm locked in! Ah! I got a key. I got a key to something. You're on to the third God Eater. Don't people say that's the bad one? Or am I way off base? I don't know a lot about that series. Why do you say maybe I should straighten it and then not straighten it? No idea. Maybe it's the second that people don't like. One of I feel like there's one of them people don't like, but I'm not sure. Like I said, I would have played them with you, but you poo-pooed the idea and said you didn't like me and wanted to play by yourself. I'm interested in playing the God Eater games. I own all of them on Steam. News reporter's memo. 
found very important clue to Rand's murder. We'll go back to house to investigate and gather info. Got a feeling about this. It will be the biggest scoop in Fleet Street. A newspaper clipping is sandwiched between the pages of the notepad. Serial killer Hay meets Grizzly End. 11 May, 1962, West Sussex. John Hay, the serial killer on the run since early last year, has been found dead at a metal plating works. Hay is held responsible for the cold-blooded murder of several pensioners, whom he robbed before placing the bodies in a container of sulfuric acid, thus disposing of the evidence. The acid used in the crimes was stolen, leading the police to place factories in the area with stocks of sulfuric acid under surveillance. The suspect appeared at a plating factory in Horsham, and a struggle ensued. Hay lost his balance and fell from a platform into a vat of acid, ironically meeting the same end as his victims. Well, that's good, at least. Although now he's going to be a super ghost killer. Corpse looks like it's been burned by something. Back off, lady. I usually play games solo for Strim to keep my own pace and not needing to adjust for others, I guess. I get it. Does games like Monster Hunter slash God Eater? Feels weird to me to play alone. Those games are better with other people, to me at least. Yay, I purified you or whatever. Gave you your lost item. Invisibility band? That's not even that useful. Um, there was another ghost in this area. What other items do I have? Oh, I bet I need to put that teddy bear in the box. Horse eggs. Cut the tail. That's right. Oh, horse eggs. You have any idea how bad the urge for more Monster Hunter is hitting me lately? God Eater is fast-paced Monster Hunter. Like, I want to get back to Monster Hunter real bad. It's I feel like it's been too long. I haven't chopped off a, a a dragon's tail in a while. Sigil stone. None of those were that useful. What key items have I got? A key I haven't used, maybe. Master. Oh, the master. Oh, that's for the concert hall. I don't know. All right. Well, working on 3.0 banger times. Our reverse engineer guy made real key and urgent quests possible in G rank. Really? It's better when you're really little play instead of being burnt out. Yeah, and I burned out hard when I, I don't know. I put well over 200 hours into it in a, I don't know, like two months. Between all the Monster Hunters I played, probably like 300 hours in a couple of months. I was super burned out. But lately, the urge is back. Alright, I'm missing something. Freaking ghost is annoying. Oh, that's the cameraman's ghost, maybe? Let's go back upstairs. No, stop it. But I'm toying with the idea of doing, like, a Monster Hunter adjacent game. Ooh, toolbox. It's locked and will not open. Like, a Monster Hunter adjacent game instead of actually another Monster Hunter. Like, I have ne I never really played, even though I bought it, that, um... Oh, what's it called? The, like, more recent one. I think Activision made it. Didn't, did Activision make, like, a Monster Hunter? Like, like I know I bought it. I think it was Activision. Or someone like that. Doing Toikiden after God Eater. I own Toikiden, and I really like what I've played, but I barely touched it. Hmm. But I'm thinking of, like, you... What is the name of that game? This is driving me nuts. It's like, uh... You make, you make like, wooden things that you can, like, use. Yeah, EA, EA, not Activision. What's that called? I have that, and I barely touched it. That might be fun to play. Maybe I'll give that game a real chance. Wild Hearts, thank you. It's Wild Hearts. 
That game's, I feel like it's already completely forgotten. It just didn't leave an impression on anyone. But it seemed all right when I when I messed around with it a bit. I, I honestly only put like a couple hours into it. You don't like their monster designs? I don't even think I've played, I only saw the first monster in that game. I didn't even play it long enough to see a second monster. Hmm. Dang, ghost, chill. Kind of annoying trying to like search with this ghost constantly on my butt. fix this yet because she keeps saying I should fix this and then she doesn't maybe I should straighten it yeah maybe you should why won't you now I remember when I so I played Wild Hearts briefly when it first came out and it did have some uh it didn't run great it clearly had some issues with performance but I heard that got largely fixed. I don't know. Ah, the film's been ripped out of the camera. If I had some film, maybe I could purge the spirits. Where the heck's your film, dude? Maybe it's outside somewhere? We can look around here without getting attacked now. It's very dark in the manhole. Another ghost. Dang. Mom? Oh, that's my mom? Mom, what are you doing in the 1960s as a ghost? Dick's desk key. Wait, can I go back to my time anytime I want? Because that's an interesting change. It kind of seems like maybe that's what it's telling me right now. Oh, I can. I didn't expect that. I assumed it was a one-way thing. Dick's desk. I know where that is. Run by the spooky ghost. Stop that ghost. The music changed here. The music was not this spooky in my house last time. Is that weird guy still in my room? This is Dick's room. Hey, an order from the camera shop. What? Only about lots of film. What? I had to come 50 years into the future to get film. Book of Entities 2. In order to defeat a subordinate, the murdered soul, which acts as its energy source, must be healed. To instigate the healing process, a sentimental item belonging to that person must be obtained. If and when this item has been found, 
The Rooter power is boosted temporarily. The Rooter portal square appears, and within is found the sacred weapon necessary to vanquish the subordinate. Okay. Hey, a mask. Range mask. Well, clearly I hang that in the missing mask spot. That's kind of too easy. These puzzles are not exactly real head scratchers, but they're logical, which I enjoy. After the last game, where a lot of the quote unquote puzzles, there was no logic to them, they were just stupid. Hey, we got film. Is that grandfather's writing? 1978, man, we're jumping around the time a lot. The ruder who battle the entities are scattered all over Europe. We, the Hamiltons, are also of ruder stock. Of this lineage, I am proud. The ruder blood is passed down to females. My wife, Francesca, was a ruder. In my naive youth, I did not believe any of it. I denied the presence of entities and ruders alike, preferring to believe that it was all just an old wives' tale. But then I found the Book of Entities, and Nancy began to sharpen her ruder powers. I finally opened my eyes to the truth and began my research into the subject. Eighty-four. The ruder powers first appear in a young woman's early teens and peak at age 15. The powers then gradually diminish, usually disappearing entirely by the age of 20. For generations, the women of the Hamilton clan have spent their teens fighting against subordinates for the ruder cause, before marrying in their 20s in order to produce the next generation of ruders. Nancy is already 18. Her ruder powers are dwindling rapidly, and it is almost time for her to pass the job on to the next female. We Hamiltons think of our ruder blood as something of which to be proud, as well as a responsibility that must be taken very seriously. I am sad to give my beloved Nancy to another man, but it must be done. I will watch her marry with a broken heart. Another ruder has been born to the Hamilton household first grandchild. I chose for her the name Alyssa. She is bright and lively, perhaps even a little strong-willed, and yet appears somehow wise beyond her years. I pray she will grow strong and healthy and will fulfill her obligation as a noble ruler. A ruder family. So, I am a ruder. It's in my blood. Oh, blimey. Leave it to me, Grandpa. I have the same ruder strain in my blood as my mother. I can save Dorothy and Albert. Then, and only then, will I be able to leave this nightmare and see my mum again. I'm sure that's the way. Isn't it? Thanks, Gramps. I'll take it from here. Uh, where was that secret room? I did not finish exploring in there. Hey, let me in the room again. There we are. Cameras. Grandpa, what's with all the cameras in your secret hidden room? Oh. arrow. Grandfather, mummy, look at these old photos. Looks like filming the arrow and the letter. All right, back to the 60s to save that poor family. It's still less sad than the first story where this poor little girl was murdered. 
That story was overly sad. Hmm. We gotta deal with this bathroom ghost. I'm going in that bathroom whether you like it or not. We don't know what she wants, right? Maybe she needs shampoo. She still has hair. What item do you need in here? A towel? You need a towel so you can dry off? Nothing in here. Back to the 60s. We have camera film now. We haven't even met our serial killer here yet. Save. Ghost Town, second stage. I wonder how many stages there are. I have no idea. I know nothing about this game. Playing blind. I rented it when I was a very young child. Well, not that young, but when it actually came out on the PS2. But I don't think I even got this far when I rented it. Yeah, yeah use the freaking film, girl. You should be able to figure that out on your own. Come on. Yay! Now he's happy. Got pictures. This must be a photograph from the crime scene. I'll say that's pretty incriminating. Can't really see the suspect in it. I wonder if the person who took the photograph ended up a victim as well. <laughs> All right. There's another photograph. Photograph of an open door with a hidden switch. Behind that painting that I clearly could have moved at any time. Is that one of the doors in this house? Yes, it is. You yourself commented multiple times that you should fix that painting. Okay, this way. All turned around. Here we are. Hey! open the door we're free another safe point another door ooh, ooh what disgusting little bathroom it's filthy I bet we're going to run into the new killer any second now. It's time. We've been in this time period for a bit. and I haven't seen him yet. Walk from the other side. What a depressing little area this is. Even if there wasn't supernatural serial killers and ghosts around, this is just a sad little place. Label reads sodium chlorate. Sounds flammable. Yeah. 
sure does. Sounds salty. Mother, what are you doing? I told you, you shouldn't wander around outside by yourself. I came to tell you that dinner's ready. And I told you that you don't need to be worried about me. Your old mother may have dicky eyes, but she's not on her last legs yet. You just concentrate on your work. Anyway, what is it you're making this time? Some new toy that'll have the local kids a gog, I bet. Actually, I've been busy making this. Oh. Albert, what's this? Winter's coming, and I don't want you catching cold, wandering around outside. I've been making this in my spare time. How is it, warm enough? It's lovely. So warm and soft. Thank you. Thank you so much. That's enough play, happy family. You make me sick. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, that's what happened to their eyes? He sprayed them in the face with acid? Jeez. That's somehow even worse than what I had pictured. This game is twisted. No, oh, don't acidify me. Oh, what was that? I was glowing. Use this. So is he chasing me? That seemed like that dealt with him for now. I, I feel like I haven't fully explored that room. I gotta go back. Anything else in here? Ah, there is. Invisibility band. Okay. I've been collecting those and I haven't used any of them. I should probably start using them when I get chased. Toolbox key. Oh, I know where a toolbox is. I know where to use that. Oh, I bet her little scarf thing is the sentimental item I need, but it fell down there. So we have to go like the sewers to find her scarf, maybe? That would be... They clearly set that up as the sentimental item. Alright, let's go to the toolbox. See, right? All right, I think he'll probably be able to see now. <laughs> go, go, go. <laughs> I didn't, ex I thought he might disappear. That didn't quite work the way I hoped. Ah! Oh, that was a bad plan.
Leave me alone, you meanie. I don't want to take an acid bath. Where's the exit? Isn't there an exit in this room somewhere? Ow! Oh, crap. I thought there was an exit in here. Is this not the room that had the photographer guy in it? I guess it's not. I got the rooms confused. Wait, the toolbox room. That's over here. We're gonna open the toolbox and then run. Where is it? Was it in here? I thought the toolbox was in here. Now I don't remember where it is. Oh no. Ah! Ow, he sat on me. Shut up. Where's the dang toolbox? Ah. Maybe we can hide in the bathroom? It's filthy. Can I hide in here or will he find me? chasing me or did he give up I mean I don't hear him maybe he gave up but where was that toolbox that I couldn't open. Hmm. I know I saw a toolbox when I messed with it. I said it was locked. That wasn't in my house, was it? I was sure it was here in this time period. I'm going back in there. Oh, crap! Come on! <laughs> Ow! Let me use my thing! Come on! Oh, I'm gonna die! I died. That's my first death this whole game. That's so annoying he never came through that door the whole time I was in the bathroom. All right, is there, there is a continue. All right. I wasn't sure if I'd have to load a save or what. How far back does this take me? Well, it seems to just take me to my last save anyway. Do I have the key or do I still need to go get the key? I do have the toolbox key, okay. Excuse me. I'm pretty sure a toolbox is in here somewhere, and I want to find it. Maybe it was upstairs. It wasn't in here, was it? Where the heck was it? Hot, hot, hot. Ah, horse eggs, do you have perfect memory? Can you tell me where... No, oh, toolbox, it was upstairs. Yes. Hexagonal wrench. Thank you. Let me brush my knees off. Crazy acid wielding serial killers chasing me, but let me take time to brush my knees. 
Can't have dusty knees. I think I lost him momentarily. He'll probably find me pretty quick. No, I didn't mean to save. I wanted to refill. Oh, whatever. No, I don't even care about saving right now. Just refill. Thank you. There she is. No, there she's not. <laughs> ah! Why were you in there? Is that is that Dorothy's shawl? Oh, that's what I want, baby. We want the shawl. We want the shawl. Oh no. Use the hexagonal wrench while he's right behind you. It's fine. It's fine. We have time. Excuse me. <laughs> Thank you for stopping and letting me slowly crawl through this. Yeah, he's not that. I mean, you know, he'll acid your eyes out of your head and then burn you to death, but he'll just let you crawl through a tunnel if you need to. Man, he is not giving up the chase, though. I gotta lose him somehow. No, Ghost, I don't have time for you. Hide in the locker, idiot! She won't hide in the locker. Can I read the letter? A cable is sitting in the puddle that is just asking for electrocution. Can we electrocute him, maybe? Alright, let's stop and read this letter. I'm sure he won't mind. Daughter's letter. Oh. Ah, don't acid me! Very rude. We were just speaking very nicely of you. How do I lose this guy? Ghost, I'll be back. Locked from the other side. Dude. Oh? Crawl button. He doesn't want to come over here. Found a safe spot. Stupid dead end. Oh, looky looky. I almost thought this was a dead end. That was close. Alyssa, you're stressing me out with these crazy walks of yours here. Ooh. I don't know if I can fall on these, but I feel like I probably can. Ooh. Ooh. That does not look sturdy. That doesn't look sturdy, Alyssa, go! Uh, the shawl! Yes! This shawl, this must be Dorothy's shawl. Honestly, pretty impressive that he swims with all that get up on. And even that huge thing on his back, I'm honestly impressed. Um, can you stop, please? Eh, eh. Oh, we get a cutscene. You copied me! I'll destroy 
None of your lip, little girl. You have your own destiny to accept. My destiny? You must die, Alicia. I don't wanna. Oh, we're fighting back already? That was fast. We haven't returned to the shawl yet. I'm confused on the lore of how this works. I thought I had to give the shawl back first. I guess I can give the shawl back after. All right, well, it's boss fight time. Man, we're zooming through this game fast. Corroder. 31 victims. That's that's pretty good body count. Sentence to 605 years. Judgment. There she is. There she is. Ah. Hmm. So he's gonna like dodge my attacks, huh? Ah. That complicates things. Cause I can't turn while I'm aiming. But I need him to like stand still. There she is. Oh, prepare to die. Oh. Ah. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Charge, charge. Got him. There she is. Ow. got him ladies and gentlemen we got him yeah you gotta charge it for a long time and you can't turn while you're charging it oh i gotta stretch thank you sir i needed that oh that didn't finish him i thought that was a kill when you hit him with that there she is. Oh, it almost there finished him. Me. Blood flow energy. Very there good. She is. Oh, prepare to die. Come on. Do whatever you're doing. So you basically have to, like, bait out certain attacks that you can attack him during. He's about to die. Like one more decent hit. Damn it. Oh, sidestep. There she is. Got him. Oh good, killed him during the ad break. Perfect. Sorry for anyone stuck in that ad break. Freaking Twitch sent you to an ad right as I beat the boss. Clover of Courage. All right, he's dead. drop anything i thought he dropped some sort of shiny uh there was stuff down there that i never i didn't finish down there because i was getting constantly chased there was a ghost that we need to like cleanse its soul oh it's not gonna let me go back down come on game let me go back down all right 
We gotta go help the poor sad ghosts first, then we'll go back down and get whatever I missed. You know, Capcom, I see what you're doing with giving the main girl here, like, a super tiny skirt and having her crawl all the time, and I don't appreciate it, as she's supposed to be 14 years old in the story. You want sex appeal, Capcom. Make, make the character an adult, please, next time. All right, now, where are their... Oh, I probably need to go back to the old lady in the uh, other house. Yeah, even though she died in here. Peace. That's kind of cool. Like, remember this game's kind of old. Like, the physics of, like, all this stuff, like, falling over when you run by it, it's kind of cool. Like, this, this is PlayStation 2 technology. PlayStation 2 was an incredible system. There, there was... The, the amount of, like, technology and arts that they were able to wring out of this system, like the really talented developers, is, is still something to be admired today. Alright, she should be in here. Like, go, like I, when I played, like, the Silent Hill games, like, dude, Silent Hill 3 on the PlayStation 2? That game, like, could come out today for the PS5 and, and look acceptable. waited so long for you. Remember this? Is the winter shawl you knitted for me? Like four seconds before we were both murdered horribly, remember? I can see. I can see too. I would think that would be a bad memory, but I'm glad it works for them. Thank you, Alyssa. You're welcome. Thank you. Dorothy, Albert, goodbye. 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 What the world's going on here? Oh, we're back home again. Oh, this guy. He was there at the beginning of the game. Quite a feat destroying two subordinates. Uncle Fester. The strain appears especially strong within you, Alyssa. I guess we'll save. I hope I can go back there. I'm sure I missed something, which I really hate. I'm going to be thoroughly annoyed if I can't go back at all. I gotta admit, I didn't see this coming. And we got some techno music now. I think we're going to a rave. But she's enjoying it. This game is so weird. This is no longer your home. This is the dark realm where I rule. Be the devil? In two hours, the clock will strike midnight, and your 15th birthday will arrive. When that happens, you and I will become one. 
and together we will obtain eternal life. My... my 15th birthday? Are you looking forward to it? So am I, my dear. So am I. I can't wait. Soon we two will be united forever. <laughs> Alyssa, you might have defeated two of our number, but your mother was killed by a subordinate long ago. No! You're lying! She can't! If you don't believe me, you can go to hell and see for yourself! <laughs> You know, Hill doesn't look that bad. I've seen worse. That looks kind of peaceful, almost. This game has the wildest, like, just a little warm. Yeah, I know it looks kind of cold. Oh. More lavender water. It has like the wildest shift in tone. Some parts of this game are like so dark and disturbing and sad. And then it's just like the weirdest, goofiest cutscenes. Like anyone that wasn't watching part one when I streamed the first like chapter of this game yesterday, it's all about this like 12 year old girl that gets horribly murdered while her father's off fighting World War II where he dies and then like all she wants to do is win this piano recital to make her father proud while he's at war but then she fails in the piano recital and then she's horribly murdered and then she finds out her dad died in the war like it's so sad Doomstone has a crest engraved on it this must be quite old why does it look so familiar huh Light is filtering through. I could crawl through here. Let's do it. Use the dedicated crawl button. And avert your eyes from the 14-year-old girl's too short skirt. I'm watching you, all of you watching the stream right now. You avert your eyes. And turn. Ooh. A ghost. No ghosts. I'm one of the good guys. I am wondering though, like, I wonder why this series died because this game, you know, I'm joking on it a bit, but it's actually been a pretty fun game. I like this game. And I know they made Haunting Grounds after this, which is, you know, kind of like an unofficial Clock Tower 4. Uh, but this was the last Clock Tower game, which is weird. So heavy, I can't get it to open. If only I had something to open it with. I am legitimately surprised this didn't get an official sequel. It's really fun. Worker's key. Where am I? A fish. It must get bored out of its tiny mind down here. Can fish get bored? I feel like probably not. Oh, it's a hiding spot. Oh, I'm gonna be hunted soon then. Okay, well let's that's remember that's a good hiding spot to remember. A diary lies open with an incomplete entry. Alright, we got a key. Uh-oh. Oh man, wasting no time getting a killer after us now. What the? Alyssa, you might 
might have defeated the others, but you're no match for me. You're going to die by my hand, girl. <laughs> Dude, he looks like a fighting game character. He looks like he should be in Soul Calibur. Not a horror game. Like a Mortal Kombat character. Eh. That guy fit right in in like Mortal Kombat Deadly Alliance. Hi. Oh, nice trick. <laughs> Oh, nice trick. <laughs> Ooh. Lost him. One note I would give this game is the serial killers are all a little bit too action-y, and they're not that scary. Like, the first one's this huge muscular dude with a giant sledgehammer, and this guy now looks like a fighting game character. None of them are as, like, horror-y as Scissor Man from the first couple of games. It's locked. Who's the worker's key? But the actual, like, running away from them and interacting with them is a lot more exciting than in the previous games. It's a lot faster paced. I want a best of both worlds scenario. I'm hoping that's what Haunting Grounds will be. I'm very excited for that game. I've never played it before. I'll play it next. Oh, wow. He came back fast. Okay. Oh, main electric cable's been cut. Way too risky to touch that with bare hands. Ooh. Sigil stone. Forget what those do. Something inside the wooden box. It is... Ah, it's telling me how to connect those cables together, but I don't have a way of touching them yet. I need some sort of, like, insulated gloves, maybe, first? Rubber gloves? Then I can do it, maybe? Take that! Man, but the killers, though, they are a little overly oh, nice trick. Uh, overly aggressive in this game. Like, man, they are on you so fast. Like, even when you lose them, you only have, like, a minute or two before they're on you again. Oh, nice trick. Uh, oh, nice trick. Uh, At least this guy's having fun. He likes hide and seek, apparently. Okay, he's gone. We made a little progress. Let's uh, refill and save. Okay, so I have a two, I have one or two keys I haven't used yet, or what do I have? I have, oh, I never returned the daughter's letter. That was from the last level. Um, I've got, no, uh, I don't have anything for here. Okay, I got nothing. No keys, I don't think, that I haven't used. Uh, where did I originally come from? I wanted to go back to where I started, but... Where was that? Was it over here somewhere? No. I could have sworn there was another exit out of here. Something to open that with. Some sort of pry bar. 
crowbar or just a big metal bar I can pry something open with. I tried to use that elevator again, but I'm assuming I have to fix the power cables before I can use the elevator. But I'll try it. D1. Oh, it does work. Okay, my bad. I was wrong. I'm glad I tried it. So I was probably in basement two. Oh no, I went past, past it. So I was in basement three. Three floors to search. Yikes. That's a lot. Oh, come on, dude. You can't get away. Yes, I can. What is this? Circuit breaker, the power's been turned off. Raise the lever. Doesn't seem to be doing anything. Okay, that's what I need to fix those wires for. I bet. What is this? Gloves! That's what I need. Insulated gloves. Rubber gloves. Perfect. Now we can fix those wires. Stop it! Leave me alone! Oh, that looks locked. That's bad for me. Electronic door locked. Power indicator lamp is off. That's bad. Ow! Oh, you can throw axes? That feels like cheating to me. Ow! Jerk! You can't get away! Yes, I can. Catch! Alright, we're gonna go back to B3 since we know where to fix those wires. Then we'll go check B2. Plus, we got an easy way to lose that guy if he attacks us here. Which he is doing right now. Alright, let's recheck that form I got. Or I guess maybe it's a file. Uh, here we are, maintenance manual. So A1, B3, A2, B1. So what, we go to 3, and then to 1, and then to 2. 3, 1, 2 from the top. Um, let's attack upper left to lower right. Um, middle to lower left. And then upper right to middle. Alright, now we can turn that on on B2. Or B1. Oh, here he is. I was wondering what's taking you so long. Like that. Oh, nice trick. <laughs> you think he'd get better at searching this room as uh, this will be the third time I've lost him in here now? Nice trick. <laughs> oh, nice trick. <laughs> it's not even a good hiding spot. <laughs> Just like you can see through the fish tank, buddy. All right, let's check B2 now, and then we'll go up and flip that switch.
<laughs> Hello. Oh, a crowbar. We need that. All right. No, leave me alone. Oh, nice trick. <laughs> you gonna light himself on fire? Nice. <laughs> he hates getting lit on fire. Fire's burning. Okay, let's, uh, what order do I want to do this in? Let's go flip that switch first, and then we'll go back down to the first floor, or the third floor, and use our little crowbar to see what's in there. I'm assuming flipping the switch will do nothing but power on that uh, electronic door lock, and I probably need a card key or something before I can actually go through it, but let's check. It was down here somewhere. Here? No, those were the gloves were. There it was. Nice. Yeah, it's powered on, but it's still red. So we need to find some sort of hard key. Mother Invisibility Band. I really need to start using these. How many of these do I have? Five? Plus six Lavender Waters? Yeah, I never use these. Next time I get attacked, I'll try to remember to use those. Okay, back to B3. We use our crowbar. been a minute and a half since I got attacked, so it's probably about time for him to show up again. Wait, 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 wait. I went the wrong way. Where, oh, you took the elevator? Used crowbar. Go down. Yes, go down. Well, hello, Mr. Skeleton. What you got? What is that doing here? Couldn't have been locked in here. It's holding a note. A message is scratched on the paper. How many days have passed since he locked me up in here? I can barely write anymore. I came in to rescue you. But now I too have been made a prisoner. I have broken my promise to protect you. Soon I'll be unable to even to record these feeble thoughts. I have lost the spectacles which you gave me. Is it too much to ask for any remnant of you in my last hours? Oh. So he wants his spectacles? Yeah. Oh, well, right there, buddy. Those weren't very hard to find. <laughs> I feel like, I guess if he didn't, couldn't see, What's he supposed to do? That was the easiest search I've ever been on. Here you go. Bleh. Ooh. What do we got? Yo, Frenchie. Oh, card key. Nice. How's it going, Frenchie? How was work? Did you have a great time? We're powering through this game, Frenchie. I'm basically speedrunning it. It's kind of fun, but it's not very hard. So, 
not having much trouble zooming through it. Work was okay, got the weekend off. I'm happy about that. Congratulations. That's very nice. My day's been pretty good. Ow! Well, until that guy threw an axe at me. But, you know, I'm back to streaming a game I'm actually having fun with, and after how much I hated Ghost Head, uh, this is fantastic. <laughs> this is a game that, nice on a normal trick, day, uh... I might give, like, a 7 out of 10. Oh, he found me? Oh, I panicked! I might give it a 7 out of 10 on a normal day, but after Ghost Head, this feels like an 11 out of 10. Like, it's the greatest game I've ever played. Oh, you know what? I have items to make my panic go away. I always forget to use them. This guy's actually kind of tough. Uh, use another one. Dude. Quit attacking behind you. I can't use my holy water. There. That's all I wanted. Man, I'm using a lot of resources trying to get away from this guy. Well, because I panicked while I was hiding. Oh, nice trick. <laughs> oh, I see if he gets close, that panic bar goes up fast. You make any especially good food today? Did you get better brownie mix yet? Boss said he can't get the previous significantly cheaper brownie mix. What? Why not? That's crazy. It's cheaper. That should be all you need to hear for him to be like a done deal. Let's go back to the cheaper stuff if it's better. They don't have them in stock at the distributor. Ah. Oh. And you have one specific distributor you use. You can't like pick and choose. Or you mean that specific brownie mix distributor rather than a general distributor you use. I'm assuming you guys use like a major distribution company of some kind for like all your stuff, but I don't know that. All right. Use the card key. Door's been unlocked. Arrow. I have like three places the deliveries come from. Okay. Their save point. Yes, let's save. one I was given when I was a child. This is my childhood home. Am I about to find baby me? Wait. 
the statue. Oh, that's the gold statue from the other games. That's something to tie it together with the other games. That's kind of cool. For now, I'll have to work with this crappy one. Hopefully, the old one will be available if he sees any. Yeah, hopefully. Locked. So I'm back in the house. Very interesting. What is going on? Nancy, what is Mum's name doing here? Philip, darling, father, Alyssa has laughed for the first time. And the last. Killed my happy. Oh, dang. I hate it when Grandpa does that. Why did Nancy have to marry a man like you? A man with no spy, no spirit. Dang. Time to fight back. Yep, boss fight time. Drama. Yeah, the story's a little meh in this game, but it's not bad. That was a decent twist. I didn't see it coming that my grandpa was a bad guy. Then we got the Sailor Moon stuff with the teenage girls versus the forces of evil. Kill that be. Still, we never got Chopper's story. I liked 44 victims. I liked hearing like the background of who the other serial killers were. This is just some crazy guy with two axes. We got no history on who the heck he is or what he did.
You can't get away. Yes, I can. Ah! Uh oh, he sidestepped me. Just too far off. Go. You can't get away. Kevin. You can't get away. Kevin. You can't get away. Once he kind of get how it works the boss fights are really easy like the first boss fight i struggled a lot because it's a super weird system but once you sort of get it it's really easy it's just a matter of finding a time when you can charge up for a long time you can't get away to the side you can't get away Chopper is my grandpa, and that's why they haven't told me anything about him yet. I mean, my dad did die from hitting his head on an axe. Maybe my grandpa is a crazy serial killer. Probably. That's my current theory. But you'd think she'd recognize him, even if he, like, shaved his head and put red paint on himself. I don't know. Okay, what do we got here? 12th May, 1998. My sweet Alyssa, her small... Sweet oh, Alyssa, he'll read it to us. Her small hands have grasped my heart and will not let go. But to think that the father of my beautiful granddaughter is Philip. It is more than I can bear. I consented to the marriage so as to protect the ruder bloodline. I realize now that was a foolish mistake. The man lacks class and has not a shred of dignity. He loses no opportunity to exhibit his stupidity and weakness of character. <laughs> we Hamiltons have no place for men of that nature. Even Nancy has been affected by his rubbish, saying that she does not want to raise Alyssa to be a ruder. Of course, the existence of a ruder is fraught with danger. But given the gravity of the situation and the great responsibility of a ruder family, the obligation cannot be shirked. Any attempt to avoid such a duty is indeed shameful. As long as I am the head of this house, that man will never be accepted as one of us. Finally, Philip went too far. I could no longer allow him to defy me. But that headstrong act has turned me into a vile murderer. I must carry my secret to the grave. I cannot allow the Ruder line and the Hamilton legacy to be disrupted. There is nothing to be done but handle the police carefully and tread with the utmost caution. I don't know. Sounds to me like Grandpa had a point. My dad does sound like he sucked. Maybe he made the right decision there. You can't have a weak man representing the Hamiltons, right? Alright, 
happened, so I'm in a spooky graveyard. Daxter is cool. Raiding, thank you so much for the raid, Daxter. How you doing? What's up, Ireto Esselry? I probably pronounced that wrong. We're just seeing some... A Greek or Roman ghost doing a weird dance right now or something? I don't really know what we're seeing. You guys Tell got me. here just in time for a uh, information dump here, apparently. Ritual of engagement. All those were ruder ghosts. I didn't catch it. They were all supposed to be ruders. Ooh, a thing. Is that? I'm underwater. What were you streaming, Dexter? use that yet I think let's keep looking around opening Pokemon trading card game booster box was a stream ah, you're a Pokemon player you know I can never get into trading card games my one of my best friends oh I can save here one of my best friends through college and I uh, we were roommates for a while after college as well uh, because I'm a boomer uh, was a semi-professional Magic the Gathering player that traveled around the country and did Magic tournaments and had a pretty decent amount of success. Uh, and I tried to play Magic with him a bunch. I tried to get into it. I just couldn't get into trading card games. Ah, you're a collector, not a player. Okay, fair enough. Do you collect them to keep, or are you, like, uh, all smart about it and, like, make money off of it? Like an investment? I play Magic, non-tournament rules, my cards date back to 2011. Very nice. Yeah, my buddy Brandon uh, did both. Like, he had, obviously, tournament legal decks and stuff that was non-tournament that had older cards, and he did everything. Keep first copies, give the rest of your siblings. Cool. All right, so it's just like a fun collector thing. That's cool. Wait, this looks familiar. I've seen this before. Read the engravings. Yeah. A curse upon any who would desecrate our sanctuary. Only she of ruder blood may heal our wounded spirits. That's me. I got ruder blood. Oh no, there's ghosts. Oh, hello. So I've been playing through the entire Clock Tower franchise. This is technically Clock Tower 3. This is technically ooh, ooh, the last official Clock Tower game. So I've almost done playing through the whole series. Sky Rooter Stone. Uh, but there's one more quote unquote spiritual successor after this that. The rumor was it was developed as Clock Tower 4, and they changed the name later. 
So I'll probably play that as well. And that game's called Haunting Ground. So that'll be after this, and then I'll be done with Clock Tower. Letters are engraved in the wall. Read the engraving. Tomb of the Ruder Warrior, Captain of the Seas. Painting of soldiers on a ship. Okay, so I have Sky, this is Sea, so clearly I'll be moving around, switching them out with the correct rooms. So I need some sort of Sky room for the one I just got. What do we got here? Oh, got that out, ghost. This looks like Sky. Cannot be removed. Only one may be carried. Oh, brutal. Okay. Letters. Read the engraving. Angel of the Air. So this is where I want the air one to go. And guessing the next room will be C. Have the C stone. Whatever. Let's check. Hello. Like that. Hey, ghost, you're in my way. Ah, let me go. You jerk. Wow, that hurt a lot. Uh, that's C. Yep, I can tell from the picture. And you're... Protector of the Earth. Okay. Okie doke. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I know how to solve this now. Oh wait, not this. No. This. You go here. Now we'll pick up the sea stone and then go put that in the sea spot. I wonder if I can throw uh, holy water on the ghosts. I've never tried. Will that let me get by you? Yes, I can. Nice. Yo, Battle Boss! How's it going, buddy? I saw you play in Stellaris earlier. How's that go? Ah, get off! You're a jerk. Yeah. A new species, huh? What species you playing? Get out of here, blue ghost. All right, one down, two to go. One where you don't need to spend minerals on mining stations because they get built over time itself. Interesting. I've definitely never played that one. All right, so this is... Earth. Yes. You know what else I want to try in Stellaris? I've never tried a Mega Corporation. I don't really know the mechanics of how to play as a Mega Corp. I think next time I play Stellaris, that's what I'm going to try. I want to learn how that stuff works. Yeah, get out of here, ghost. Megacorp's pretty cool unless you have a lot of hive mines around you. Oh, hive mines don't play well with megacorps. Puzzles about to be solved. Oh, they don't have trade value. That makes sense.
can't build your own outposts on their planets, I see. So this game came out, like, at uh, such an awesome point in horror game, like, survival horror game, especially from Capcom. This is a Capcom game. I wonder if that's why it never got a direct sequel. Because this was competing with, what, Code Veronica and, like, Resident Evil 4? Silent Hill 2 and 3, like, those were the types of games it was up against in the genre at the time. This was just, like, the golden age of survival horror games. Because this is a really good game. I'm surprised it's not more, like, well-remembered. I'm having a great time with it. PlayStation 2 just had too good of a... Too good of a, a software library, I suppose. Even good games kind of got forgotten. Wait, that was up here, not up this way. Alright, what's this? Compass of Light. Sounds useful. I think we're done here. Alright, so one of these is going to be for the Compass of Light, and I'm guessing the other one's Compass of Dark or something. I got two round indentations here. It's her Compass of Light, yes. But, should be able to get the other one over here. Let's see what kind of puzzle we got waiting for us here. Freaking anime villain. Nancy is not the only one. This graveyard is full of the bones of those who I have destroyed. Oh, this guy killed my mom. You're lying. What a jerk. Now. Prepare to hand over your heart. The ritual engagement will begin shortly. <laughs> Wasn't this guy a member of Akatsuki or whatever? Naruto? He's so anime. Ah! No, not the butterfly crap. It's so annoying when the butterflies start attacking. They make me stand still. You can't get away. Stop it, butterflies. Yeah. We got here. There's a switch inside its mouth. Yeah, press it. What'd that do? Yeah. There. Move it. We gotta lose this guy. What is this? Something's written along the outer frame. Purify thyself with holy water and awaken the lions in order. How am I supposed to know which order? Uh, statue of three eyed. Oh, so the other one's two eyed. This is three eyes. So what, is there a four eyed lion? Ow! A nerdy lion with glasses? One eyed line, so what? It's gotta be one, two, three, right? Is it that simple? Also, I didn't purify myself with holy water first. I don't know how to do that. We gotta figure out how to purify ourselves with holy water, I think, and then maybe do one, two, three with the lions. Dude, leave me alone! Oh, crap. I 
can't move. Oh, I died. If you get panicked, you just stand still sometimes. It's very annoying. Okay, so we gotta purify ourselves and then light these lines in the right order while this dude's chasing us. Game over. You know, I think this is only my second game over this whole game. I'm not dying very much. Maybe it's my third, but I think it's only my second. Okay. So we... Oh, I wonder if this cutscene's skippable. I hope it is. We gotta still gotta figure out how to purify ourselves in holy water. That I don't know. Is there like a waterfall I can walk under or something? Maybe it's something at the car with my mom. Hope this is skippable. Okay, good. No, oh, run this way. Run back. All right, what do we got here? Way to stop and read my mom's letter while you're about to kill me. It's mom's handwriting. Twenty-two, three. Two weeks until Alyssa's birthday. I'm so worried that I don't know what to do with myself. I sent her to boarding school so that she wouldn't have to fight as a rooter. But will the entities let Alyssa's heart go so easily? They say a rooter heart is necessary in the ritual of engagement. A rooter heart taken from the body of one who has reached her 15th birthday. I only hope that she can elude them until her birthday is past. Mom, sounds like you're an idiot and you should have taught me to be a rooter instead of what you did. Mummy, are you really dead? All right, no, no, stop it. Leave me alone. Oh, I should try my band of invisibility. I've still yet to actually try using one of those. Oh, nice trick. <laughs> Let's try it right now and see what happens. Am I invisible? Oh, I did I just straight up turn invisible. I found another one. Beautiful. Let's see how long it lasts. Oh, nice trick. Okay, it didn't last very long, but that's a good way to get away. When he's right on my butt. Too holy water. Axes? There's axes everywhere. Does this guy live here? Oh, nice trick. <laughs> we did it. We found a place to hide from him. Okay, I thought I was going to have to have him chasing me this whole time. Maybe he won't disappear, though. Sounds like he won't actually disappear, so I can just buy myself a little time hiding in here. Freaking ad break. Pausing it for the ad break. Sorry if you are not on the ad, but... I have the ad breaks as minimal as I can, but I can't turn them off completely. over there we go welcome back anyone that was in the ad i had it paused while you were gone lavender water very nice book of entities three in 1655 a woodcutter by the name of harold powell was born in cardiff wales hideously deformed at birth he suffered the taunts and ill will of all those around him at 17 years of age, he proposed marriage to Emily Dickens, the innkeeper's daughter, but was cruelly rebuffed. In retaliation, he is said to have dismembered Emily with his axe. For years following the gruesome event, he went from village to village abducting young girls and butchering them in the same fashion. Two years later, he was caught by villagers and killed. However, Powell was possessed by an entity and revived to hunt for rooters as the head of the subordinates. Ah, so he's the boss of the subordinates. And now we actually know who he is. His body count's gonna be massive, I bet. Oh, it sounds like he just came back inside. Hide again! Oh, nice trick. <laughs> oh, he did disappear. Okay, well, now we know who we're dealing with. Um, We do not know still how to whatever, cover ourselves in holy water or whatever it said. Ooh, a save point. 
but I'm pretty sure one if I don't find anything telling me like a specific order for tigers or the lion heads or whatever. So I'm assuming it's just going to be one, two, three. Since I didn't find a letter saying like two, three, one or anything. Mummy, are you really dead? Claudia Hamilton. Oh, stupid butterflies, go away. I hate you guys. Okay, one eye was over here. Wait, there's holy water surrounding it. Can I do something with that? No? Hit the... One. Now let's go to two. I think that was this one. Ah, oh, crap. Two. myself well, I mean I didn't I don't know what it means I purify yourself hmm purify yourself in holy water how do I do that we gotta explore a little more I guess first we gotta lose this fool ah get up get up get up woman Find myself in holy water. Hmm. Well, we can refill holy water all we want. You try this gate over here. I assumed it was locked. It sure looks locked, but let's check it. Yeah, no. No entry, I guess. Can't go against what the sign says. Alright, let's check around here if there's anything we may have missed. Who in the world would I purify myself in holy water? I could... Turn the gate over here back on with holy water. That's something, but that's not myself. Some and then immediately run through it because that's still not using it on myself. Oh, great! Man, he comes back fast by so little time to hide from him. At least it's pretty easy to get in here and lose him. Hmm. Let's 
anyone in chat's got any ideas on how to purify myself in holy water, let me know. This is actually the first time in the entire game I've been a little bit stuck and didn't immediately figure out what to do. By the way, Jay, nice trick. Which trick? What do you mean? I have no idea. No, I mean, what, what, what do you mean by nice trick? I don't follow. In the house? No. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah. He is indeed very impressed when I hide in his shower or whatever that's supposed to be. I mean, we got water here. Is Maybe there's maybe what I did wrong is... No, no, don't do this, Lion. Oh, wait, the eyes are still lit. How do I unlight the eyes? Are all their eyes still lit? His eyes are still lit. Is that, all their eyes are still lit. What does that mean? What the heck am I missing? Oh, great. Oh, that was it. I just need to use holy water on this. Okay. Well, mystery solved. We got the compass of shadows. You know what? Let's, uh, we've been stocking up on these. Let's just turn invisible and just bail. See you fools later. Don't go that way. That's the way I'm going. Why is he walking the way I'm going? Now he's going to see me immediately. <laughs> that's, that's so annoying. Get out of here. Can he use my magical portals? It appears not, so that worked out. All right, we got both compasses. Let's see what's next. All right. Ooh, we made a new portal or something. Wait, I don't want to use you yet. Let me refill and save. I wonder how long this game is. We got a chance of beating this today at the speed we're rushing through it. Making good time. cool if we don't, but I feel like I might beat it today. I'd love to end the stream beating this and then tomorrow just a clean break to Haunting Grounds. I'm really excited for Haunting Grounds. I've always heard that's one of like the best kind of hidden gems on the PS2 and I've never played it. I feel like we're almost at a real boss fight with this guy. Binding arrow. I haven't been using any of these arrows I got. I think there's a special way to use them that I forgot what it is, and I've just never done it. Should remember that. Oh, this must be the ritual of whatever. My true desire is to become an entity. There is no purer path than this. Remove the heart of a 15-year-old brooder of the same bloodline, and before the beat of our heart is stilled, drink deeply of her blood. Thus will the ritual of engagement be completed, and the dark power of the entity shall be thine. What? 
That's why they're talking about my heart. But who? Who wants to drink my blood to become an entity? Who would do this? Grandpa, duh. That should be clear. Grandpa's super evil. Although he did like her a lot. He was like, oh, I love my granddaughter. So maybe not. What world is happening now? Whoa, fancy arrow. What is that? Yes, please. Old rooter arrow. Okay. A gruesome inscription has been carved. Who wants to use my heart to become an entity? How dare they? What are these statues of? Entities? Oh no! Got to hurry back to the gate. Jeez, Cam, this is so annoying. The camera keeps moving. Trying to get me killed. Stop it, camera. There we are. All right, real boss fight time. Alyssa! What chance does a pathetic little girl like you have to bring salvation to the dead rooters? None! There we go. Fight time. No, you know, it's not Sailor Moon, it's Bleach, right? Didn't, uh, the, there was that type of, I haven't watched Bleach in a very long time. Like, more than ten years, but there was that whole family where they made magical energy bows, right? Chopper! Speaking of anime, it's like One Piece. 44 victims, sentenced to 921 years. Come on, Dr. Chopper. All right, I wonder if I should use my special arrows, if I can remember how. How do I use them? That, did I use one? That didn't do much. Oh! jumped on me. That's far less effective than hitting me with an axe. He's just toying with me. You can't get away. Dang, that was a direct hit, but it didn't pin him. What the heck? Oh, okay. Shoot him when he th right after he throws. That's his secret. Because he blocks it otherwise. Ooh, that's kind of tricky. You can't get away. So the enemy will catch, and then I gotta let loose.
Or it looks like right before he swings. Basically, he has to be doing something. That's kind of good. This is a this is a good fight. Stupid grave. That's so annoying. Cut. Cut. Dang it. Okay, and that stops him. So after I shoot him right when he heals catch, and I should have time to charge one up and get a good hit on him after. Start charging immediately. All right, I figured him out now. I know how to beat him. Here. Now. Now I got him. Full charge. Got him. There we go. That's the trick. Got to figure it out. Get him. Yeah. That's for my mom. This is the last one. Try this. Clover of Hope. Hey, that's three of the four. You're saved. Thank you, Alyssa. Thank you, Alyssa. Thank you. Destroy the subordinates. Don't let the ritual of engagement happen. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye. Alyssa? Easy, Alyssa. Mom. Alyssa, 
It is I who will carry out the ritual of engagement to become an entity. You have no choice but to succumb to my final subordinate and donate your heart. Oh man, Dennis is still Alyssa. around. Someone Dennis. kill this guy. Alyssa, are you all right? I've been looking everywhere for you. My mother, my mother was. What happened? What's the matter with your mother? I hope he's the last subordinate and he's secretly a serial killer. It's four leaf clover necklace, but one of the leaves is missing. This is my last chance to see my mother again. I can't defeat the entity without all four leaves. Alyssa, it'll be okay. I'm here. I'll do anything to help you. Dennis. All the leaves will be found in time. You have to believe me, Alyssa. You're right. I'll find all the leaves and save Mum from the entities. That's the spirit. Don't forget, you can count on me. If there's anything I can do, just ask. Just one thing I'd like to know. What is this place? It's Clock Tower 3. Fourth stage. Oh, we got Dennis the Menace with us now. What's wrong, Alyssa? What's wrong is you're following me, you little nerd. How do we get outside? Huh. Alyssa, wait for me! Dennis! Dennis! Where are you? Sis! What? Oh, okay, I didn't see that coming. You said she wouldn't be back for another six months. I know, but that's her. No mistake. I'm sure of it. Linda! Wait, Dennis! Come back, Dennis. I couldn't leave you in that house alone any longer. I'm here now. I've missed you so much, sis. Uh oh. Dennis, watch out! <laughs> I've missed you too, Dennis. <laughs> that is a split in half giant pair of scissors, isn't it? Very cool callback. The scissor man. Yes, kill Dennis. Oh, there's two of her. Oh, those were those, the statues were those two. When I said, who are these statues of? Nice to meet you, Alyssa. You have some remarkable powers. But no one is powerful enough to defeat us. If you want your friend alive, give us your heart so we can create a new entity. <laughs> Dennis. How is she holding the net? What's going on there? I don't care if they killed Dennis. 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 That's the worst hostage they could have possibly taken. I kind of hope they do kill him. What do we got here? Photo of mother. Okay. Oh, a ghost. Uh, are you looking for a photo of your mom? There's a body here, too. Who would do something like this? Do you want a photo of mother? 
Oh, not for you. Move it. Ah, leave me alone. Uh, Dennis's letter to Linda. Hey, sis, how's Africa? Have you seen any elephants? I'm not too bad. Living alone is really hard, though. Don't know how you managed to raise me. I'll never say this to your face, but I do appreciate that, you know. When you get back, I'll find a job and do my share. Just another six months. I'll, it'll go by in a blink. I'll write again. Take care, Dennis. Hey, sofa. Oh, you don't have time for a nap right now? Door won't open. This is stressful music. It's like anxiety inducing. I'm not even being chased right now and I feel like I am. It reminds me of Drakengard. This is like Drakengard music. Where it's all kind of like grating but on purpose to make you uncomfortable. I love Drakengard. Ah, we got a hiding spot. Bathroom hiding spot, classic. Classic clock tower. Okay. Uh, I came from there. Did I already check this door? Yeah, I did. It's locked. We got a bathroom. We got a door that also appears locked. Three keyholes. Oh, working mirrors. Look at this tech. Look at this technology. No games have working mirrors. Not anymore. Uh oh. No. Not showtime. Okay, so only one of them hunts me at a time? That's nice. I thought it was going to be both. You can't go in the girl's bathroom. That would be against the rules. Idiot. Did he see me? He did not. He somehow missed that. Working mirrors in video games are very cool. There's a message written along the frame of the mirror. When the twin demons meet, the real world is revealed. Oh, interesting. That's interesting. So, no illusions if they are both there? Crawl button. Looking glass. Okay. Cupboard doors won't open. They're not broken. There must be another way to open them. Like a switch or something? Do I have an item I could use? I mean, a looking glass wouldn't make any sense. Uh, strange motif on it. Definitely not a normal mirror. Yeah, that... So I don't think I have any way to open that at the moment. Really? Won't open from this side either? Alright, well, we find, uh... Oh, crap. Where is he? Come on, Alyssa. Oh! Owie! That was cheating. I couldn't see you. Back to the bathroom. Not allowed in here. So I notice it's the guy again. I wonder if they each have their own sections they like patrol.
Hmm. Oh, hello. This person must have been a victim. The corpse is holding something. A furiously scribbled journal entry. How many bloody months have passed since they locked me in this excuse for a clinic? Those idiot doctors still find reason for me to be here. I demand to be released. Every time I get a hospital release form, it is gone by morning. Get me out, please. Please let me out of here. I fear I will go mad locked up in here. Ooh. Wow. Ah! So he wants a hospital release form then, right? Well, that's what we need to find for him. Poor guy. That's brutal. Get me out from here. That's, like, gotta be one of the worst nightmares. Getting, like, permanently stuck in a horrible place like this. Or really any mental institution. Alright, well, let's go look around elsewhere. Check these, right? I think these were both locked. Okay, this is the room I started in. This way. Oh, there was a thing. What we got here? Lavender water. Ah, spooky ghost. Sculpture of a woman fetching water. Phone line's been cut. Labeled key A. Ah, okay. Maybe that'll open that cabinet I couldn't open. Still. Yeah, where's your body? Oh, you're probably the person on this. What do you want? Patient on crutches, even the sick and wounded. Do you want a picture of your mother? Yes! Rid of this ghost. Billy Man, and now we have a safe room to save in and refill on water. Very nice. All right, so we got a key. Uh, scissors Hospital. I need to go back now. I have to find Dennis. Oh, that's the exit. Okay, makes sense. That's where I came from. So what's through here? Is it an elevator? It, it's not. It's a nothing. Can't interact with it. All right. Move it goes. Well, we need to figure out what that nurse wants. Because that lady's annoying. Alright. I don't think the key will work in any of these doors, but we might as well check. I think I think it's gonna go in that cabinet upstairs. Crap. Back to my safety bathroom. Always have a safety bathroom. What are you doing? come in here this is the ladies room get out all right Let's see if I'm right about that key opening that cabinet
Oh, well, I think if it was usable, I wouldn't have to go over here. I think keys usually use themselves, so looks like I'm wrong. Silver key with a label on it, just labeled key A. Oh, it's going to be one of the three keys for that door. How do I open this dang thing, then? Hmm. Another way to open it. Sink? Is there anything hidden back here? What the heck? Okay. So yeah, that door had three keyholes. So I'll probably need key A, B, and C. Maybe I open it from this room? Like from the other side of the wall? Oh, dude, come on now. You're an annoying guy, you know that? Here. Yep, that was one of the keys. I need two more keys. I'm sure one's in that cabinet. Come on, Alyssa. I don't know what the third one's gonna be. is reacting to the mirror yes all right sweet we figured out a thing door's not gonna open everything's backwards now that's actually kind of cool we're in like a mirror world uh release form that'll make that guy happy that's what he wants This is an interesting mechanic. This game keeps throwing kind of interesting mechanics out. Is there more to this other world? Yeah. Maybe I open the cabinet from this world. Interesting. Maybe the girl attacks in the mirror world, and it's the guy in the regular world. Ah! Yes. Lavender water. Oh, lavender water. Oh, it's probably unlocked in the regular world now. Okay. Uh oh. There you are. Ah, uh, it's the girl in the mirror world. Called it. Excuse me. I need to find a men's room. He's allowed to go in the ladies' room. Excuse me. <laughs> Anywhere to hide? Ah! Ah! Bunch of butterflies! No! You freaking butterfly jerks! Ah! Stop it! I didn't realize I could holy water the butterflies. Stop it! Get off! Rooms. <laughs> I don't think she'll see me go here while she's wounded. We'll find out. I gotta admit, they, these are the least scary killers yet. Uh, something about their design, not very scary. They're kind of silly. 
Although I do like that they have the scissors. That's a callback. Although I do like this game keeps having a different killer in every level. That does keep it fresh. You don't really have time to get too bored of one killer. You deal with them and move on. What? You just disappeared! You cheater! I heard her disappear! Am I too slow? I think she's here. Alright, disappear for reals this time. Oh, wait, I may panic. Is she too close? Leave before I panic. Oh, man. I may die now. I, I didn't want to use my lavender water. I should have. That's on me. You know what? Let's use one of our invisibility things. I think I actually managed to juke her. That's kind of fun. Photo of a child. Maybe that's what the nurse wants. Someone's gonna want that photo of a child. Alright, we're going back. Oh, what? She found me! No! I'm out of holy water. Oh, there's something in the bathroom. Ah! This is very bad. This is very bad. Get yeah, whatever this is. Key C. Sweet. Excuse me. I don't think I need to be here anymore. I think I can just run back through the mirror. Slice and dice. Pretty sure we got everything we need from this side. Oh, dude! Oh man, I lost him big time. He has no idea where I went. All right, that's twice they pulled that crap. That's not cool. That's super annoying. Oh no, the crawl button doesn't work while I'm panicked. I couldn't crawl through the hole. I'm dead. I don't like that they fake disappearing and hide around that corner. I find that very annoying. How far back did I get thrown? Oh, not which which is this the reverse mirror world? Nope. All right. I barely got thrown back at all. That's not that big of a deal. You know what? I need holy water. We're just going to run all the way back and grab our holy water. I need to go over here anyway. Pretty sure I can heal the nurse. Zooming with this. Yeah.
It's an arrow? That's not that great. Didn't they not attack over here? I guess they don't follow you here. I didn't expect that. I assumed I'd still get attacked over here. Alright, full holy water, quick save. And I'm pretty sure I know where to go get the last key, and then we'll have that door open. It's either going to be from giving the release to that guy, or it's going to be in that cabinet I should now have unlocked. One of those two is going to be the third key. camera changing angles all right we should be safe unless he just goes behind that corner on, Come on, Ooh, my panic's going up you need to leave buddy okay good Literally watch him disappear. Let's see if he still is hiding behind that corner and hits me. Probably is. Oh, not this time. Alright, first let's get the ghost guy. And then we'll go grab what's in that cabinet. Buddy, I got something for you. Sigil stone. I'll take it. So the key must be in that cabinet. We got all the keys. Sweet, what are these things? Okay. Ooh, holy water. What else we got in here? Anything? I wonder where this is gonna take us. Find out. Ah, yes. To a dirty canyon. My first guess. Grandpa! I knew it! Grandpa? Grandpa, don't eat my heart! Second April, nineteen ninety eight. 
Today is Alyssa's... Is he going to read it? Today is ah. Alyssa's 10th birthday. Right. The ruder powers will become visible any time now. Alyssa is growing up into a lovely young lady. She is everything to me. And I wish for nothing more than to watch over her all her life. But I know that is not to be. Every step she takes towards adulthood is a step away from me. Must I leave her? I want so much to be with her always. I have stumbled across an incredible document. An account of a ceremony called the Ritual of Engagement. It is written that by obtaining the heart of a ruder on her 15th birthday and drinking her blood, a person can be transformed into an entity and receive the gift of immortality. I am disgusted by the nature of this ritual, of course. But at the same time, there is a part of me that cannot resist its allure. If I tore out Alyssa's heart with these hands and partook of her blood, I could be joined with her for all eternity. <laughs> Grandpa! Am I capable of such a... Oh, crazy old Grandpa. Must I desecrate my beloved in order to save myself? Yet another amazing discovery. The legend of Lord Burroughs. In the document is a mysterious triangular crest. It is said that the one who is able to decipher the secrets of the crest will be able to become an entity. I suspect that this too is related to the ritual of engagement. But what could the letters A, D, and N signify? I must know. Somehow, I must uncover the truth. The answer is hiding out there somewhere. Lavender water. Ooh. Oh no! They followed me! Um, hurry up! Stupid crest! Ow! Dang, he has more reach than I thought. Stop it! These are actually some pretty awesome statues. Kind of cool. Finding arrow. Oh, geez. Ah! Stop it! Okay, he's gonna make me lose it. He's get this guy is fast. Will he get faster? Need some lavender water. Huzzah! 
Slow it down, pal. Employee's memo. I've received orders from Ralph and Jemima to kill still more. I cannot continue in this fashion. I killed 10 last week, and this week they want 20. When will it stop? Soon there will not be a person left in the entire village. I must do something about this. They are to be imprisoned in the kitchen. One of the steel bars on the window can be removed. I do hope that they are able to see that before it is too late. And once they escape, I pray that they will tell the world of the atrocities that go on behind these walls. Interesting. I wonder if these two are Jemima and what's it? Ow. Shut up. Over here. Dude, how do I avoid those attacks? I don't know how to avoid those. He's so fast. I'm sure the girl will attack me over here, it seems like. There's a pattern to this. Who a ghost? I don't think I can cross here. Oh. Ooh, walk a little slower. This way. Nothing. Thought I was being clever trying to go that way first. Ghost, please don't hurt me. Oh, jeez. Go back. No. Go forward. Do I have to find this ghost and deal with it first? Is it going to kill me if I do this next to it? Guess we'll find out. It's gonna kill me, isn't it? Please be cool, ghost. Okay, so the ghost can't hurt me while I'm ledge... or ledge leaning, whatever you call this. Good to know. Where's your body? Over here? Ah, oh, there's the bar that it was talking about. In that letter. What do we got? What do we got? an old jotting pad on the desk. If you wish to open the other path, calm the flames. There are mounds of ash brushed into a pile. I heard that they used ash to extinguish fires back then. Oh, great, great, great. I unlocked the door. <laughs> Get me now, idiot. Bet you can't come over here. I wonder if this is a safe spot. Can I wait her out? I feel like there's no way she can get here.
She must know I'm here. She doesn't seem to be leaving. Okay. Well, she'll probably attack me immediately here. Nice. That was awesome. I am satisfied with that. Okay, so we want to put the ashes in here, right? A crest. Safe point. Ooh, and more holy water. Very nice. Man, what's up with that candle? Is that a shadow or is that a thing? Turn to the original place, yes. Oh. Hello. What was the purpose of that, I wonder? Dang, all that for moving a candle a little bit. Ah, that's where we use the crests. I got an A crest so far. The groove designed to hold something, and the groove is inscribed a letter N. There will be a D and an A. Large painting, there's a title on it. N, loving mother, suffers in place of daughter A. I mean, that seems kind of obvious, right? Wasn't my mom's name Nancy, and my name's Alyssa? Nancy suffers in place of Alyssa? Is this where I came from, or did I come from the other door? I think this is where I came from. So we gotta find the other crest. Ah! <laughs> no! You leave me alone. Oh man, both doors look exactly the same. I don't know which way to go. I think I actually came from this one. Or from the other. Wait. I have no idea. I guess I'll go this way until I'm sure this is where I came from, and then I'll go the other way. I think this is the one I came from. No, it's not. No, yes it is. <laughs> this is where I came from. Uh, she won't fall for the same trick again. Oh, there's a skull in here now. Charred skull. Okay. Well, I'm glad I came back here then. You know what? Let's just go invisible. Alright. We don't use these very often. Hopefully we'll lose her while we're invisible. January 2000, Dick's Notes. Oh, it's Grandpa again. I have trudged around the blasted continent until my shoes are almost worn through, but it is no use. Where is the castle of Lord Bunners? 
That is the only place where the mystery of the triangular crest can be solved, I feel sure. It is hard to believe that three years have flown by since I embarked on my journey. I am not a smidgen closer to finding Brothers Castle. Meanwhile, I grow older by the day, and my health continues to decline. I am certain that Nancy has by this time found my journals and realized my plan to seize Alyssa's heart on her 15th birthday to carry out the ritual of engagement. How Alyssa must have grown in my absence. How I wish to be with her, to be one with her. And yet, I do not have the courage to perform the ritual. What do I do? If I do nothing, I am no better than her father. This Hamilton, at least, should have spied. Grandpa, you went a little bit crazy, didn't you? Slice and oh, dice. come on. Don't slice and dice. Lavender water. Nice. Slice and dice. These ant camera angles. <laughs> Can't see. Interesting. Hmm. I kind of want to let my fear or whatever run down naturally, but boy, is that slow. Oh, it's speeding up. It's speeding up. Well, they, I'll go in once it's down to the halfway point. Hey, it's the end. Perfect. over here? Nope. I'll kill you. I would rather you didn't. Excuse me. things out. Ah! You're still here! <laughs> the music changed, so I thought she disappeared. I can't properly search any of these rooms. I always have a stupid killer after me. Get out of here. Oh, the door locked behind me. That'll work. That's a nice desk. It'd be hard to get any work done in this office. It's too fancy. For now, yeah. What is that contraption? Is it a projector? 
Whoa, look at that painting. That guy looks awesome. Ooh, the D. He's nuts, Crest. Book of Entities, four. Lord Darcy Burroughs. All right, maybe the D's for Darcy. Owned much of Southeast England at the beginning of the 17th century. He married Natalia Hamilton of the illustrious Hamilton family, and they had one daughter, Annabelle. Ah, okay, so Natalia Annabelle Darcy. That's what the letters are for. Despite his harsh reputation, Lord Burroughs loved his daughter dearly, bequeathing all his lands to her upon his death. In the 50th year of his life, Lord Burroughs, fearing the impermanence of life, learned of the entities and the ritual of engagement. With his daughter almost 15, he made the fateful decision to perform the ritual, but then disaster struck. On the day before her 15th birthday, Annabelle was killed when her carriage rolled onto its side. Shocked by the sudden death of his beloved daughter, as well as his inability to realize the ritual, Burroughs fell into a deep depression. When his despair finally dissipated, it was replaced by raging anger. Though he had both the coachman and the maid who were with Annabelle at the time of her death killed, it did little to... Oh, how do you... I, you know, I feel like an idiot. I know exactly what that word is. Assuage, I think, but I don't know how to pronounce it. And now I'm all self-conscious of pronouncing it wrong on stream. His anger. The massacre of his staff continued even extending to villagers on his lands. Lady Burroughs did what she could to convince him to stop the savagery, but only succeeded in inflaming him further, and she too was felled. Lord Darcy Burroughs eventually died, crushed between the huge cogs that formed the mechanism of the clock tower of the castle as he escaped from mobs of angry farmers. According to legend, he vowed to plague the world with hate and terror for as long as the clock tower remained standing. Alright, so we want to destroy the clock tower, right? Something's trapped between the volumes. Oh, another dick note. That's uh, my grandpa. I have found the Burroughs Castle. I have finally solved the mystery. Lord Darcy Burroughs had a daughter, Annabelle, but also a son, William, from his first marriage. Although Burroughs himself was killed, William escaped lived out the rest of his days in peace under the pseudonym Billy Brown. Billy Brown. What a strange twist of fate. Although I took the Hamilton name when I married Francesca, my father was a Brown, a descendant of Billy Brown, which means that I am directly related to Lord Burroughs. The A, D, and N crests also make perfect sense now. Lord Burroughs' beloved daughter Annabelle's name, his first name, Darcy, and his wife's first name, Natalia. My name is Dick, my daughter is Nancy, and my lovely granddaughter is Alyssa. Destiny weaves its web in the strangest of patterns. Does the legacy of Lord Burroughs live on? The fury of he who failed to become an entity? Is it futile, after all, to fight against fate? Game reminds me too much of my real grandpa. Uh, he also ate his granddaughter's heart on her 15th birthday. Dennis. Nice! Dennis. Come on, kill Dennis! Dennis is the damsel in distress? Oh, Dennis. Ah, that's the hole where I put the D, it seems. If you know what I mean. Let me just slip that D in. There we are. Uh, that 
just re-unlocked the door that I'd already come through. Let's go back where I came from. I didn't even know that door had been locked. All right, I feel like boss fight's coming up soon. Cause we still gotta kill these stupid twins. Oh my. Oh geez. Uh, and then we're gonna have to deal with Grandpa. Obviously, he's gonna be the last boss. Um. Oh jeez. Hello. Who are you? What? There's nothing in here? No, don't go back in that. That is not what I meant to do. Ah! Oh, no! One-shotted. Oh, I should have crawled under that, shouldn't I? I have a crawl button, after all. There's gotta be something I do down there, but there was not a single thing I can interact with in that little cage. All right, that was, that was like no punishment at all for that death. What about is this one too? Are these all elevators? Iron door, it won't budge. There must be a way. Oh, hello skulls. I have a skull too. I add more skulls to that pile of skulls. That's not where I came from. No, I came from there. So what's in this one? missing here what's the point of these little elevators just just yeah 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 um yo i'm okay there oh wait no no stand up she's so slow when she crawls okay now go what Dang it! <laughs> All right. Hmm. Sloppy. These guys are worse than any killer in this game so far. Okay, well, I want to go down this one again because I unlocked it. Oh, wait, no, it wasn't this one. It wasn't this one. I want to unlock that door. I wonder if I can unlock it from this side. So I opened this door. Okay, you can open it from either side. Wait, maybe that was the right one. And then I went through here, and then I went up and died. Wait, so this is a different room, right? What room is that? No, this is... How did I just end up back here again? What the? Okay, so I need to go across. Okay, so he went... And he went, go. Now he's going to go down. Come on, run. Yes. Wait, what's down this one? I haven't been down this one. This is the only one I haven't gone down. There has to be something down here on one of them. Ah, a thing. An invisibility band. That's it? This guy has no head. Do you want do you want a head? I have a head. No, oh, he doesn't want the charred skull. Oh jeez. Um 
Well, I'm, so this area down here is a lot bigger than I thought it was. The door prevents entry. What's in here? So I guess the point of this room might just be so you can kind of cross that trap room without actually having to run under the traps. Maybe. Either way, I think this is the one where I want to go. Back in here again. Oh, great. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I wanted to save. Can I save while she's trying to kill me? Yes, I can. We'll save in slot two. Oh, no, we don't really need to. We can deal with her. We'll save in slot one. We got full, uh... All right, I'm guessing we want to go back to where we started. Tell with that ghost yet. This is kind of slow, so I hope I'm supposed to go this way. I don't have to do this again, back the other way. Did I get any items other than that skull? I got the skull. I don't think I got any keys or anything. I did get information. But no. No particular keys or items like that. Alright. Where is that body for this ghost? Is it down at the bottom? I don't know how to get down there. You know what we spice? Uh oh. Where is she? Ah! Slice and dice. I just realized all this messing around here, I haven't even tried to go up the main stairs yet. I don't know what's up there in the proper tower. Let's find out. Let's try to actually climb the stairs. Who designed these stairs? This is going to take forever to climb. I feel there would have been a far more practical way to make this staircase. Oh, there's a hole in it. Can't go any further. The stairs have crumbled away. Dang it. It'll take 20 minutes to go back down. It looks like there's a fireman pole in the middle. That probably saves some time on the way back down. There's, a, there's no reason to make the stairs like this long each. I would fire this architect. Although the statues are cool. In battle boss no worries isn't it like three in the morning for you you need to get some sleep at some point maybe there's something up here i missed come on Alyssa. yes all right so this guy's still here 
Is there anything else up here? I think I got it. Whoa, this is new. This is guy that lost his head. Yes. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Here's your head, buddy. You're welcome. An arrow, eh? Okay. Now... There doesn't seem to be a way... Wait, another arrow. Two arrows? Did they give me anything else? No. Okay. Still, no way to cross. Um, probably worth coming back to use the skull, though. Hmm. Well, I could try going back to the hospital. I felt like there was nothing left to do in the hospital, but I'm kind of uh, at a loss for what to do here. Is the hospital where they were threatening to kill Dennis, or did they bring him here? Maybe I have to go back there to save Dennis. So it looks like going back is not an option, so that's good. We confirmed that. So I my best guess is something down in that dungeon area where those statues took me down to. I think I missed something down there. Because if that's not it, I don't know. I feel like everywhere else I've explored pretty thoroughly. Oh, shut up. Oh, you hit me? Let's head back over there. I'm pretty sure there's no other doors around here I've missed. I think I've been pretty thorough. again, which is a little annoying. Not that big of a deal, though. There's not that many rooms to check, and I think I can be 100% confident wherever I'm supposed to be, it's over on this side of this bridge. So, there's only a handful, like, I don't know, four rooms to search over here, something like that. Shouldn't be that hard to figure out what to do next. I bet it's in that dungeon. Although, man, my four hours for the stream are almost up. I kind of wanted to beat this today, but I'm probably not that close to the end. I bet this still has a couple hours left in it. I'll probably have to beat it tomorrow. Still, this is a really good game. I, uh, even as I'm approaching the end, I'm continuing to have a very good time with this game. No. Miss anything in here? Take this knife. Check these pots. Got what was in there. Anything over here? No. I searched both of these. All right, 
right, I could be missing something in this dining area. My guess is th there's something down here. That's my guess. This is like the one thing that we opened with the stuff we did in that crazy office room. Uh, so let's see. Let's thoroughly explore this room. Put the door there. I've been in there, but I died after, so maybe I need to go in there again. Then I'll have used all four without dying. I don't think... I think officially I've not been in there, because I died. Here... There door and there's a couple of doors that won't budge. I gotta figure out how to open those doors. Okay, let's go up here. There's something to do with these elevators. There's some sort of puzzle here. <laughs> Too quick for you. Oh, was this already open? Oh, speaking of, hello. I was right. It was down here. Yeah. All right. No. Oh, is it on a time limit or hmm? So what made it close? Did I step on a hidden switch, maybe? So I was right about here, right before I went through there. So I think I want to open it and then come to this elevator and come down. Like, what's this? Which elevator is this? This is on the left side by the wood door. Left side by the wood door. Let's see if my theory is correct. So I wanna flip the switch in here. I think it's timed because I ran straight there. Oh, it is time. It's a timing thing. Okay. Hmm. Or it just didn't like me going there either. All right, we're going to pull it and then just stand perfectly still and see if it closes in, I don't know, however long that was. Five seconds? I'll give it like 10 seconds to see if it closes, and then we'll know that it's a route. I have to take a specific route if it closes on its own, or if it doesn't close. Okay, so we just closed, so I need a way to make it stay open. So I need to weigh down the switch, maybe? Hmm. Let's try interacting with this lever again after we pull it. Or we have to put something underneath this door so it can't close, maybe? Lever is down. Well, that's... I know. Maybe I just have to run fast enough? Possible. I feel like that's not the solution. I feel like there's a puzzle here, but we'll try just running as fast as possible. And it's some way to keep these doors open.
Mm, oh, it was just go as fast as you can. Okay, that's not that interesting. We made it. Hey, Dennis. Come on, kill him. Fun. Oh, wrecked. Wait, it's an illusion, isn't it? Welcome, Alyssa. That was just a dress rehearsal. Now let the show begin. Lights, camera, action! Well, sorry, Dennis. I guess that made the decision for me. What do we got here? Book of Entities, five. The origin of Ralph and Jemima, the siblings who served Lord Burroughs, are unknown. Accounts relate that Burroughs picked them up on the battlefield or that they were brought over from the Orient. However, none of these stories are more than hearsay. The siblings were horrendously cruel by nature and it's said that they were the torturers and executioners during Lord, Lord Burroughs' bloody campaign. Showing a peculiar fascination for blades, and in particular scissors, they found endless enjoyment in gutting or dismembering victims while still alive. When Lord Burroughs was finally killed, Ralph and Jemima were stoned to death by the crowds. Because both were possessed by the same entity, they were resurrected together and continued to wreak havoc as subordinates. Ooh. Wait, am I back? In my house? This looks like grandfather's room. What is it doing here? Yeah, it does look like grandfather's room. That picture's still annoying me. I'll fix it. Wait, that's where I came from. So uh, there was a secret door, right? This is a thing? What's going on here? I push this? How do I leave this room? Grandpapa, please don't eat my heart. Um, hmm. What the heck? Oh, found a thing. Alyssa's drawings. Poor Grampy. Today I read a book with pretty pictures. A wolf pretended to be Grandma and ate up a girl. It was scary, so I went to Grampy's room because Grampy would save me. Grampy is really strong and he can kill a wolf. I love my Grampy. I'm going to stay with him forever and ever. Love, Alyssa. Who would have thought? Oh, he's a bunch of the, my pictures that I drew back here, it looks like. Adder, where does it go?
Oh, I'm back in this room again. My ancestor, hear me. I know of your pain and anger when you lost your beloved daughter Annabelle. Just before the ritual of engagement, my love for Elissa led me to kill her. <laughs> Illuminati. Father, Philip. Entity was everything you're doing. Is it all because of you? Do you want me to resurrect Lord Butters after 400 years to unite us and to enact the ritual of engagement with Alyssa's blood? Is that what you want? Do you truly want me to stab my dearest granddaughter in the chest? <laughs> <laughs> well, that doesn't sound bad. Once the deed is done, I will be with Alyssa forever. Return to this earth, Lord Burroughs. Join with me, and we will complete the ritual of engagement. Enter my body, and let our flesh be fused. Oh, that worked. <laughs> this is why we put Grandpa in a home now. And then he's the big fat guy that started this whole thing now, right? He's Clayface, of course. Grandpa. You, why would you try to help him when he just like was yelling all deranged about eating your heart? kind of like how childish those killers are. It's a little endearing. They're having such a good time. She's not very smart. I'm kind of rooting for the entities at this point. Alright, so what, I have to go back down to the same room again? At least I know how to get there now. Get back across this annoying room. Now, go, 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 go. Okay. All right. So I'm here to save you. <laughs> Leave Dennis alone. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, time to fight. Alright. So they only saw one of them. Am I only fighting them one at a time? Fighting two at once would be pretty tough. Scissor Woman. 22 victims. That's small time. 396 years. The last guy had like triple that many victims or something. I'm better. There's no way this is the end fight. I bet I will have to fight them both at once. What the? What are you aiming at, woman? Oh, she like disappears. Ooh. All right. So there's gonna be a trick to her. I won't aim at her. Ooh. But maybe I have to be very fast with her? Where is she? Alright. Ow. Oh, that hit me eventually. Okay. Hmm. Dude, making me actually aim it? So hard. You can't turn once you're aiming, so I have to like aim from this screen and hope I'm facing her directly. Um. All right, so I'm supposed to hit her when she's doing her tornado, it appears. Oh, that actually hit her hard. Okay, so she doesn't have very much health. It's hard to hit, but not much health. Okay, where is she? I can't aim at her, I can't see. How am I supposed to aim? From not there. Where is she? This way? I don't think it's a hit, but I'll try. Okay, cool, she is dead. How dare you kill my sister? You'll pay for it! I'll make mincemeats out of you! You were gonna do that anyway, dude. That's not much of a threat. Scissor Man! Oh, he has way more victims than his sister. Alright, so he's stronger. 
Kinda sexist. Why scissor man so much stronger than scissor woman? Oh! He attacks through my attack. That's dangerous. Hmm. Alright, he's gonna have a secret just like her. What is it? Ow. Fair trade. I hit him too. Get up. Ooh, you're a lot easier than your sister, buddy. You just got more health. This guy's super easy. What the heck? Oh. We moved. Moving to the side is my only weakness. Ow. Actually, that attack's pretty good. Bill, his sister was harder. Got him. Alyssa, why did you stop fighting him if he wasn't dead? <laughs> I'm the winner. Now to take revenge for my sister. Alyssa! Dennis, that could have backfired, buddy. Are they dead or not? Thank you, Dennis. Thank you. No, thank you. Dang it, I was you really hoping Dennis me. would die. I was something special. <laughs> Look at this guy. Oh. I really hope he doesn't survive. Grandpa. You destroyed all the subordinates. You think you're so clever, but you still have to destroy me. If you want to save your mother, come up to the top of the clock tower. I'm waiting! Grandfather! Grandfather? The real identity of the Dark Man. It's my grandfather. I have to go, Dennis. You stay here. Hey, wait a second. Don't treat me like a girl. I'm the man here. Are you? Dennis, you may be a man, but you're not a ruder. I am. Hey! So is there a whole stage left or is it basically just boss fight that I don't know if I want to try to beat it now or save it for tomorrow. It's just basically a boss fight. Uh, well, it says fifth stage, so I think there's a whole level left. So that's probably an hour or two. I didn't want to beat this today, but I don't know. We'll play it out a little bit and see how it's, see how it goes. Pretty fun game. I would I would definitely recommend this game.
very niche audience. Yeah. This game also, though, has this weird trajectory. It started out so dark and depressing. Like, stage one was honestly one of the saddest things I've ever seen in a video game. And then the game just kind of has gotten sillier as it's gone on to where it's not really dark and depressing anymore. I if I crouched but underneath this. Oh, interesting. So why am I crawling down here? There's nothing here. Is there? Did I miss something? Crawl under this, it looks like. Maybe? No? Oh, I guess I was supposed to crawl all the way? Looks like out by up the back somehow. There we go. Can you turn? Welcome back. If you were in the ad, you missed some very exciting crawling under gears action. final stage here. Hey, hello. How oh, strange, that's a lever here. Yeah? Ooh. Pull this lever too. Ah, well, mystery solved. So I gotta say, I am, what is it? Today's Friday the 13th, right? I'm blasting through the Clock Tower series a lot faster than I thought I would. I'm gonna have to play uh, a second horror franchise this October. I wonder what the next one's gonna be. Might have to have another vote. Uh, Cause I think only got one game left before I'm done the Clock Tower and that's only even questionable whether or not I should count it as part of Clock Tower or not. That's kind of cool. Whee. Uh, oh, now. Oh. What do you think, Frenchie? What's, what's your favorite horror series? I don't think I could do one as huge as, like, Resident Evil. That's just, there's just too many Resident Evil games. Maybe Silent Hill still. You don't have one? Grandpa! Grandpa! 
I've been waiting for you, Elisa. You don't know how hard I tried to find Butter's castle in order to become one with you. I searched and searched for three years, and at last I found it. Butter's castle used to stand in exactly the same spot where the Hamilton house is now. It's not a coincidence. It's all the entities doing. This is our destiny. Grandpa! Don't look so sad. Once the ritual of engagement is complete, you and I will become a new entity, and we can be together forever. No! Please, Grandpa, come to your senses and give me my mum back. Your mum? Your mother is right there. Mum? Mum! Nancy betrayed me more than once. She married that weak, lily-livered, good-for-nothing Philip. And then she tried to prevent me from becoming one with my most precious granddaughter. That's why she's there. There was no other way, Alyssa. Damn you! You're not my grandfather. I don't know who you are anymore. But I know that I'm a ruder. I'll destroy you and save my mother. Fool! 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 In a few minutes, the clock will strike 12, announcing the arrival of your 15th birthday. Then, the ritual of engagement will huge. commence. <laughs> now, Elisa, time to lie down on the altar and prepare to surrender your heart to me. <laughs> Hey, that doesn't seem fair. He has magical tie me to the altar powers. Where are you, Alyssa? Alyssa! Dennis! Alyssa! Dennis! Give up, Alyssa! No one can help you now! <laughs> Not even your dear mother! Oh, brutal! You broke my mom's statue! and I will now carry out the ritual to become a new entity. Ghosts haunting the human realm, subordinates dwelling in the shadows. Gather here to witness the glorious ritual of engagement. Yadohe, Adohe, Adonaihe Ton. The time has come at last, my dearest Alyssa. Merge into one entity with me, so that we can be together forever! <laughs> nice. Dennis did something not stupid. Now I got extra superpowers. You little Oh, awesome. Maybe this game has a good ending. I hope Dennis died. Looks like the last boss. Lord Burroughs. 
victims, 115 victims. Dang, Burroughs. Sentenced over 2,000 years. Stand still too. This is the end. Oh no! <laughs> oh, that's bad. He has the same powers I have. That's kind of a cool twist. Oh geez, but his is way more rad than mine. That was a warm up round. Now the real thing. That one didn't count. To watch your little intro every time. Dude, he's got two health bars. I didn't notice that the first time. That's freaking hardcore. Crap. All right, if he hits me with the third, I'm dead. this hole that's like cutting me off from running away ow oh he slices me if i get close i guess i should have seen that coming huh oh i trapped him slightly Okay, this guy's actually kind of hard. He gets his, he shoots his little purple balls out faster than I can shoot mine. Dang, and I gotta watch this whole thing. Can't like skip this. It's not that bad. I'll probably beat it in my next couple tries. We're, we're beating this game today. We're seeing how it ends. This isn't like Lies of P. This guy's not gonna take me 15 tries. Ooh, I like that camera angle. Let's keep that camera angle, please. Lost. 
I lost the good camera angle. Fast enough though. His swing is really fast. Finding time for a fully charged attack really hard on him. Oh, I thought that would stall him. Crap. Disappear purple thing. I mean, it won't kill him, but I got a big hit on him. All right, we're gaining lots of ground here. I think I figured out how to fight him. All right, we got rid of like one health bar. What the? Oh no, I didn't know he was doing whatever in the world he's doing no don't s oh he's healing himself brutal okay now i got a new attack i gotta watch out for that's it okay good it's over there that actually might work in my favor that's that slows him down that buys me time
Yes, I give up. Hopefully I bought myself enough time. I definitely did not. Okay, he didn't suck my health at least. Figured out your new moves, buddy. I got you right where I want you. Yeah. We almost got him. I don't think this will finish him, but we're going to be close. No. Dang. Once I got caught with that laser in that corner, I had so little room to maneuver. Killed me. Dang it. He only had a few hits left. Uh. <laughs> brutal. Absolutely brutal. One, that's a one shot. Even at full health, that would kill me. And well, being that close, I know I'll get him on the next try. He's not even that hard. It's just it, once he catches you in a trap like that, it's hard to get out of it. I think I got overconfident there. die early than to get far into the fight and then die. I feel like some of those shouldn't have hit me. 
I just wish I didn't have to watch this whole thing. It takes like a full minute to get back to fighting if uh, you die here. I'm so hungry. I was supposed to end the stream half an hour ago. But I don't want to finish this. Oh well. My punishment for struggling too much on this boss is I have to wait longer to have dinner. somewhere where I can see him. It's a little easier when the camera lets me actually see him. I didn't think he'd be able to get that close to me. All right, live and learn. dodge those. Should be able to dodge those by pressing circle, but it almost never works.
Nice, another big hit. All right, this is going very well. I just need to not get greedy and ruin it. I think I did it. I think that's a game. Whew. Maybe more tries than it should have, but that's all right. Oh. child but that's enough now be a good girl and grab my hand what's the matter Alyssa don't you want to live happily with me for all eternity not over Lisa take strength from me that my mother has no escape today is Elisa's 10th birthday <laughs> the has no powers escape will become any time now Elisa is growing up into a lovely <laughs> oh I'll use my mother's head won't allow the ritual to happen. Uh, never! I get a sword now. That's way cooler than a bow. Because I got a sword the whole game. Bye, Grandpa.
Dennis died too, we truly get a happy ending. Oh, Dennis. Alyssa. Oh, Dennis. great. Mom, we did it. We did it, Mom. Oh, so your mom's still dead? I thought that she, like, was not dead at the end. That's it? That's the ending cutscene? She hugs Dennis and says, Mom, we did it. I guess that's fine. And that's Clock Tower 3. Fun game. Uh, hard to compare it with the other Clock Towers so far because it's so different. But honestly, I think uh, even though this was kind of short and I beat the whole game in just two streams, I probably had the most fun with this Clock Tower out of them. So I think I'd probably say this was my favorite one. I, I had a very good time. I had a lot of fun throughout the entire game here. Nice and short. Didn't overstay its welcome. I had fun the whole time. It was a good game. And uh, tomorrow, unofficially Clock Tower 4, uh, Hunting Grounds, which I'm throwing in as part of the Clock Tower franchise because it's largely the same people that made it. It's seen as... Uh, spiritual successor to Clock Tower 3 and rumored to have been developed as Clock Tower 4 before it switched over, so tossing it into the Clock Tower franchise playthrough at the end. And I hear it's a very, very good game. I have never played it, so that'll be a lot of fun. Let's see if there's any after credit scene or anything. I like to let the credits play out when I beat a game. Feels respectful. I'm glad they got back on track, because, boy, I hated the third Clock Tower game. Clock Tower Ghost Head, awful game. They really bounced back with Clock Tower 3. A lot of fun. And the story was weird. But everything did make sense in the end, which is a nice change. After Clock Tower Ghost Head, nothing made sense or was explained. That's some crunchy audio. I don't know if that's my headphones making it crunch like that, or if that's the emulation, or it was just a limitation of the game itself. That doesn't sound great. I wear kind of cheap headphones while I stream. Could be my headphones. Oh, it's given the Japanese voice cast who I didn't hear. That was definitely a very British voice cast for this game. Oh, those weren't voice. Oh, was this? Wait. Stun coordinate. I don't think this was, uh... Or, I mean, what's it, it looks like they did motion capture for the movements, at least for the CG scenes in this game. I wouldn't have guessed that, but it makes sense now that I think about it, because everyone's movements were so wild in the cutscenes. I guess they were trying to show off how human they were, because they did... They actually recorded a real cast doing it. Motion capture, yep, they did motion capture for the movements. Yeah, the 
cutscenes in this game were the highlight. The cutscenes were wild. Some of them were so weird. Good job, Capcom. That was odd. Rooters points. Oh, I got 20, 210,000 Rooters points. Could have done better, I suppose. There's a lot of zeros at the beginning of that. A new element has been unlocked. Oh, they got New Game Plus stuff? I'm a little curious. What's going on there? I'm curious. Save over one. Cleared file. You know, tell me what New Game Plus offers. I, it's probably Time Attack or something that I unlocked, which I'm not especially interested in, but I always appreciate them putting something like that in the game. Had I bought this back on PS2 back in the day, I would have been looking for excuses to play it more than once. It's a relatively short game. Theater, is that all it was? I hope there's more than just that. Although, honestly, some of these cutscenes, having a theater is worth it. These cutscenes are so weird. Uh, where's my very favorite one? Maybe I'll rewatch it one time before I move on from this game forever. But Dennis's introduction is the weirdest cutscene. Oh, dude. Through the window. This cutscene. I may have to clip this cutscene somehow and uh, use it for my channel. It's so weird. The way they move and the way Dennis acts. This is a perfect way to end the playthrough of this game. Watch the greatest cutscene one more time. This is the introduction to Dennis, I remind you. You don't know who this character is before this. This is how we're introduced to this absolute embarrassment of a human. Phew, I thought I was a goner for sure. <laughs> Long time no see, Alyssa. I haven't seen you since we were in primary school together. It must be three years? What do you think you're doing entering a lady's residence through a window? I have to give you something. Ah, here it is. It's the key to my grandfather's room. Mother always has this key with her. What are you doing with it? You saw her? When? And where? Calm down, calm down. <laughs> it was yesterday morning and your mother drove by in her car. Oh, and she said you might come back from boarding school and ask me to hand that key to you if she wasn't back in time. She must have known I'd disobey her and come back here. She must have gone up to meet me. We just oh, man. Hey, Alyssa, you've really changed since I last saw you. I'm going to go and check my grandfather's room. Hey! Well, it looks like you've grown up too, Dennis. Oh, come on. That was then and this is now. Wait a minute, <laughs> did you? Maybe it's just how much the voice doesn't fit at all with what's going on on screen. Something about that cutscene is amazing. All right, I need to end the stream. Uh, I'm so hungry. Uh, thanks for hanging out. I will be back tomorrow with hunting, hunting grounds. Uh, have a great day.